Hey guys, so today's video is going to be a huge, huge clothing haul. I've actually had to refilm like about 10 minutes of this. So I have loads and loads and loads of clothes that I have collected over the past month or two. Quite a bit of it is actually really kindly gifted by some brands and then also a fair amount of it is bought by myself because I'm a shopaholic, shopaholics anonymous. So I just want to say I'm not bragging at all by like showing any of my clothes. You guys already know this but you always ask for hauls and fashion videos and everything like that and I love long haul videos so I hope you guys will enjoy this. It's very hot in here right now, gosh. Also every single item will be linked in the description box down below so you can check it out and purchase any of the bits if you like them. So yeah, I'm just going to get started with the video so let's go. So the first thing I have is from Topshop and I actually bought this on holiday and I was so excited to get home to it because it's incredible so it's basically a little shoulder bag it's leopard print it's like a burnt orange leopard print it's got a big zip here and then a little one there actually it's so spacious it's so much bigger than it looks like I fit a book in this I fit my wallet my phone a book <laughs> lip gloss I love it so much so I'm so glad I bought that and then actually I have another leopard bag that oh hold on the lighting's going the sun's gone i have another leopard bag from Topshop. they actually kindly gifted this and another one to me anyway this one i'm obsessed with so it's like a shoulder bag so obsessed with it it's actually got a zip as well so you guys can fit loads in there and zip it up so that you don't lose stuff out of your bag which i think is so helpful this is so cute i haven't worn this yet because i have about 10 bags to get through and wear since i've come home on holiday so i'm slowly making my way through it but this one i'm just really really Really, really obsessed with I love a leopard print as you guys will be able to tell through this haul I love animal print and this bag is no exception and I don't think it was that very expensive either also this one I just love having like options because obviously because of my YouTube and stuff I go to a couple events so it's nice to have different options for bags for different outfits do you know what I mean like you have to have 10 of the same bag <laughs> so this one I'm obsessed with as well I actually really really wanted to buy this for ages and then um, Topshop very kindly actually gifted this one to me so I was so thankful because I'm I got an itchy arm. I'm obsessed with it. So it's just like blue fur, obsessed with fur as well. Faux fur, obviously. And then the strap is like these um what are these called like? I was gonna say hooks, they're not hooks, they're not chains, circles, <laughs> like ri metal ring thingy. I don't know guys, I'm really sorry, but I'm obsessed with this. This is incredible. Again, loads of space. I wore this yesterday and blooming loved it. I love, like there's something about having like a little shoulder bags that make you feel so girly and like cute. I don't know what it is, but I'm obsessed. So thank you, Topshop. I'm gonna move on because I have a few leopard and animal print skirts I need to show you guys. So firstly, this Topshop one, BAM! Snake skin, heck yes. Thank you Topshop because I'm obsessed with this so much. There is also a matching jacket that I do have. It's in my wardrobe though. Check out my gram, OliviaGrace.13 and maybe you'll see a photo because I need to start wearing loads of these clothes because I have so many like nice, adventurous, lovely clothes. I always just like, I don't know, I wear the same thing. I'm so boring. Anyway, obsessed with this skirt. That's all I have to say. I love it so much, so cannot wait to wear that. Kind of sad I didn't get it sooner in summer just because the weather is going a little bit Ugh, that was a horrible noise, I'm sorry. But yeah, the weather's going a little bit crap, so. These two next skirts are actually from Urban Outfitters, but they are sold out on the website, so maybe check out Urban Outfitters on Oxford Street, because that's where I got mine. But I literally cannot link them because they're sold out, and they're kind of like a one-of-a-kind product. Like, I can't find any similar anywhere to link for you guys. I'm really sorry. <laughs> Obsessed. This is from Urban Renewal, so it's basically their, like, vintage stuff, but they have more than one. They even have them, like, on the website, so I'll link them below as well so this is a zebra felt fur one there was actually a leopard one that i really really wanted but i was like Libby, you don't need two types and i didn't buy it and then i got it <laughs> anyway yeah this one i just want to say quickly this is an extra small and this fits a tiny bit bigger on me and then this extra small actually fits quite small so make sure you try on the skirt like i tried this one on but i didn't try this one on um because i just assumed they'd fit the same and they don't and evie kind of had the same problem so if you are buying make sure you do check because this one comes up a little bit small i'm so obsessed with this i love the leopard print it's so cute 
I literally just want to like shovel every print all over my body. <laughs> I mean, at least I have like three Halloween costumes there. We have a leopard, a zebra, and a snake. <laughs> so if you guys don't know, there's actually a Depop account called Past Trash where I buy loads of my clothes from. All my cherry earrings, all my cute like little earrings, not these ones, these are chop shop. Um, all my little cute earrings, loads of my like kind of Y2K cute clothes are all from Past Trash. I buy loads from them and they actually messaged me the other day and sent me some bits and I was like, oh my God, yes, please, I love you. So this came in a little package. It's like a little corset style top. It's not super stretchy, so you like need to pull it kind of, actually no, this one is quite stretchy. Can I just say, I've worn this so much that I just had to order some more colors. Cannot wait to get this in the mail. Almost dabbed then. So 2011 so that it makes your boobs look great and it makes your waist look amazing because it's just like whoosh, and it's really like i don't know it's so cute it's quite 2000s like i love the cut of it like it's like longer at the front if that makes sense i'm just really really obsessed with it to be honest it also actually gave me this dress it gave me loads of bits actually but some of it is in the wash because i've already worn it so this dress it's like hold on this is the way it's like a little slip dress so cute it's like gray it's got like floral nurse all over it you'll be able to see better on a try on clip but it is so cute it's like outward embroidered if that makes sense urban outfitters i also picked this up so thanks to urban because i'm obsessed this is a little top with these two babies on it um it says lambo news unit you can tell i didn't do french do you sessie because i cannot speak french for my life to save my life what's the phrase I don't know. It's basically just like a basic little top. So cute with jeans and a cute jacket. I'm obsessed with it. I just need like more like nice t-shirts. So this was a need. I think we actually have a long sleeve one or like a jumper or something because I was looking at it on the website and I'm obsessed with it guys. Like I'm actually obsessed. So River Island. I have this really cute cowl neck top. It's black, love cowl neck, it's so flattering. This with some jeans and these heels that I'm gonna show you later, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, that'd actually be such a good outfit. Hell yeah, hell yeah. So, love this top. It's actually a little bit longer as well, which is cute because you can either tie it, tuck it, or just leave it, because not everyone wants everything really cropped. So, love this. Thanks River Island, obsessed with that one. Ah, that hurts so much. Actually, this is a really nice bodysuit. It's from Primark, got it for my birthday, just covering the nips because that's the only problem with it. You can really see everything. I also picked this up along with the other bits that Topshop kind of gave and this I'm obsessed with as well. It's actually selling out really, really quick on the website. So if you guys do want it, check it out quick because I think the white is pretty much sold out. So they have a couple other colors like blue and red, which I want oh my gosh so this is what it looks like I am actually obsessed with it I wore it in one of my other videos quite recently actually and this is what it looks like so it fits so nice on the shoulders oh the lighting is going blimmin crazy and then it's like lace I feel like I'm talking a hundred miles an hour when you like slow the heck down so it fits so nice it's like scrunchy material what's this called like you know it goes like that and then it's on your arms it's honestly i'm it's so nice on it does look really like i don't know really pretty and like beautiful on and it shows off like this area which a lot of people love the decolletage i think that's what it's called <laughs> Next, on holiday, I picked up these trousers, which, oh my god, Zara. Yes, please, Zara. <laughs> so these are like leopard print cotton trousers. Wow, okay, guys, I'm gonna be honest. I don't have the peaches, the bum, I don't have that. These are so flattering, so I can only imagine what these would look like on someone with a big batty, honestly. These are like snakeskin cotton print flares. They sit really nice on the waist, and then they just hang and just flare and just kind of just sit on your bottom and just make it look great so God, I'm talking about bums too much I need to stop right now um these also really weren't expensive I was so excited these were probably like 20 pounds at most they have a matching top as well actually which I nearly bought the other day and then I was like Livy you don't need that top you're never gonna wear it matching you don't need the matching top obsessed with these well these like three days in a row when i got them also in that shape sh oh my gosh i cannot speak also in the same shopping trip i got this jacket as well which is like loads of people have been asking about this as well it's like a teddy bear furry print jacket i actually wish it was kind of like a jumper i mean it kind of is like a jumper to be honest probably won't wear it like when it's the freezing cold months of winter 
as it is always in England. I'm, like obsessed with it. They have a cream one which I really want but I kind of don't need a cream one because I have another one very similar which I'll show you in a second. But yeah I got a large in this one and it's still kind of small because it's supposed to be like cropped so size up if you want it a little bit oversized. Um, but I also have this one which means I technically don't need a cream one of that so I'm gonna try restrain myself this is from top shop and this is like a big borg jacket i got mine in a size eight i'm about five four by the way for anyone wondering like size wise with any of the clothes i get i'm five four um so yeah this has got a really cute collar it's like borg it's oversized and big it's so cute cannot wait to wear it in summer like summer <laughs> winter i mean or like when i'm in yorkshire and freezing my nipples off this is gonna be fabulous sorry that was a really horrid image don't know why i said that we're gonna move on jeans now this is kind of ridiculous because looking at this pile these jeans all look the same color they actually are the same color <laughs> moving on my fave brand for jeans ever is Topshop. so i have some of their black jamie flares wear them the whole time so i decided to pick up a pair of like the mid wash blue ones they are literally just flared jeans some people hate flared jeans don't know why weirdos i tell you weirdos <laughs> but yeah i'm obsessed with them these are like such a just classic for your wardrobe like check on a jumper and a coat and you're cute do you know what i mean so i just thought i actually wanted these and have wanted them for about a year and could not wait until winter when i can buy some so I'm very pleased with those. Also, from Topshop, I have these jeans, which these are called, I don't know what they, I want to say puddle. I don't know why I want to say puddle. Don't think they're called puddle. <laughs> but these are like kind of cargo jeans almost. They're so cute. These I love because they fit perfectly on my waist. And then they're like quite like, you know, what are these called? Like baggy jeans. So when you have the cinching in the waist, it's still flattering even if it's really big on the leg. These are actually really cool. So they're literally like cargo jeans. But what we can actually do is unzip this and have like long shorts. I personally won't do that, but I feel like it'd look really cool. So I don't know. I'm obsessed with them. And these are like nothing that I have in my wardrobe. So I'm actually really, really, really excited to be able to wear them. It's quite hot today, so I don't think I can actually wear jeans. Then we have final pair of jeans, which loads of people have been asking about my favorite like beloved skate jeans oh my god i'm running out of breath honestly basically they've actually sold out on the asos website which is heartbreaking they're like a light wash skate jean oh my god beautiful but i was checking out the weekday section on asos and i actually found the same style jeans but in this this wash this color i also got them in the perfect size for me the other ones i got a little bit too big on their waist so i'm so glad i got these ones which literally fit like a glove around my waist i'm so pleased because there's nothing worse than having jeans and a crop top and the jeans being a little bit too big and just not like do you know what i mean these are such a nice denim wash as well you guys know the drill or if you don't then i'm gonna tell you how this drill goes these are just wide leg straight like skate jeans i think that's what they're called i mean i've been calling them skate jeans maybe they're not they literally fit perfectly they're quite long i got these in a 32 leg as well so they're a little bit longer than like my usual jeans i usually get like a 30 but these just hit the trainers perfectly if you don't want them that long then you just roll them up and they look incredible Every Every single way i am so obsessed finally shoes five pairs of shoes almost finished this haul guys doing well well done if you're still watching i'm impressed so again urban outfitters super super generous these are my favorite shoes buffaloes you guys i'm obsessed with these some of you are gonna hate them some of you are gonna love them everyone at summer in the city said they loved them like goodness so i'm just so obsessed with them these are a little bit more pricey they're about 150 pounds but they are incredible also they're not very comfy can i just say at all but i'm not really selling them right now but they are inc like amazing they give you so much height and i just think they're like such a one of a kind shoe but saying that i was searching for a cheap alternative before i actually got them and i found these on river island and these are just so similar you guys have to know about them so these are 45 pounds these are for the more subtle buffalo winters 
whereas <laughs> these are a little bit smaller in like height more comfy to be honest and they just look more casual do you know what i mean rather than like buffaloes these are like high top trainers like trainers that give you height do you know what i mean but these are so cute as well and for 45 pounds if you guys don't want to fork out like 150 on the buffaloes then this is a good option i'm not gonna lie i love both equally maybe the buffaloes a bit more because i haven't worn these yet but honestly it's love it's real love if you've never experienced it take a look at the buffaloes and then you will okay speaking of love these shoes i actually worked with Nike for a video a little bit ago where i did a lookbook and like a back to school kind of video with them and i did a few posts and stuff so one what the heck like you guys know nike is my dream brand i mean this is full of Nike box. Anyway, so these are the Air Force One Jesters. I got the red colour because look, I've got a red tick, this little label, the like sole, like half of the sole is red. I'm obsessed with them. I've got so many compliments of that for them online and like offline, like in person. People are like, oh my god, they're sick. And I'm like, I know. They actually have a blue version with a blue tick or a black tick or all white or all black or all lilac so there's about a million different options for you guys they're sick i'm actually obsessed with them like i love them so much i need every single color um loads of you guys wanted to know where these are from i mean you know they're nike but you wanted to know their name and you guys loved them so there they are okay river island i'm obsessed with these slides i'm obsessed they're not even slides they're like shoes they're like sturdy shoes look at these they've got like borg fur and then they've got leopard print and buckles what more could you want they're a little bit more pricey they're like 35 or 40 pounds i think but the actual shoes they're not like crappy slides you just chuck on i'm obsessed with them please can summer come again so i can wear these honestly please i'm in love yeah okay so you guys may or may not follow josephine on instagram she wears shoes like this the whole time and she looks incredible. She makes them look very comfortable. These are not comfortable. These are from Ego. They're about 30 pounds. I'm obsessed with them. They look incredible. They look a bit like sexy and like jeans with a cowl neck top. That black cowl neck top. You are going to look like a hot lady or guy. Do you know what I mean? Like, yes. So, um, I'm obsessed. The only problem is the um, height and the angle at which this heel is at is a problem. These are so high and so uncomfortable. I haven't worn them out yet. I'm too scared to, but I'm going to be brave one day. Going to be brave. So, that is everything. Every single item in this video will be linked below or an alternative if I can find one. I really hope you guys have enjoyed this. If you did, give it a huge thumbs up. And if you want more hauls, do let me know because I'm a shopaholic. Also, thank you so much to the brands like River Island and Topshop and Past Trash for gifting oh and Urban Outfitters for gifting me loads of these bits they didn't do it just for the video they just did it out of just being lovely so I really appreciate that and I wanted to pass the love on and share the bits to you guys so if you do like them check out the links in the description box or check out my Instagram oliviagrace.13 where you guys can see everything here styled in real life on the gram stunting on the gram so yeah I really hope you guys did enjoy and i'll see you very very soon with a new video i love you bye